What kind of music have we been working on? I think these programs are great, you know, reaching out, you know, uh, the ability for like an inner city kid to go and watch an opera, you know, on the weekend in HD is wonderful. What is the Anvil Chorus about? The Anvil Chorus is gypsy singing and words like the gypsy singing. Yeah. It's, it's kind of like a working song because they're singing it and working. Why do you think they're singing while they're working? To make them happy. <laughs> Opera and how opera is a di it's a different type of music. If it's Italian, you should roll your R sometimes. You should roll your R sometimes because the language is different, right? But I'm really good at rolling R. Oh, can I hear? Ooh, that's it's really good. High and low. Why do you use your hands so much? I use my hands because it gets my emotions out. And what does the music do with your emotions? It makes me feel happy. <laughs> Music make you want to go like this, Gabriel. Because it's the, the dude with the stick. <laughs> Who is that dude with the stick? <laughs> the composer is the one that writes. Conductor. Oh my gosh! Say it one more time. Conductor. Exactly. If you don't follow the conductor, the, the like the opera or the the con the place you're in, it can fall all apart. <laughs> With a program such as the one we have with the Met, um, it, it brings things to my daughter that otherwise she, she, she may have been exposed to, but she wouldn't have such a warm, engaging experience in. To be able to have my children exposed to all the different composers of the world and the languages, it's just uh, amazing to have them go to Lincoln Center and uh, to see a performance and then to have um, the Met come into our school. It's, it's just that perfect cycle about um, what it is to be a real learner and to be engaged in the real, in the real world, and that's, that's what children love. Good job, you guys.